Hello students, today's topic is open market operations. Let's start. In modern economies, the way central banks change the supply of money is by buying or selling bonds in the bond market. If a central bank wants to increase the amount of money in the economy, central bank will buy bonds and pays for them by creating money. And in case if a central bank wants to decrease the amount of money in the economy, then it will sell the bonds and removes from circulation the money it receives in exchange for the bonds. These actions are called open market operations because they take place in the open market for bonds. This is a balance sheet of a central bank. The assets of the central bank are the bonds it holds in its portfolio. Its liabilities are the stock of money in the economy. And open market operation leads to equal changes in assets and liabilities. If the central bank buys say dollar one million worth of bonds, the amount of bonds it holds is higher by dollar one million and so is the amount of money in the economy. Such an operation is called expansionary open market operation because the central bank increases or expands the money supply. So these are the effects of an expansionary open market operation. On one side we have assets and on the other side we have liabilities. On the asset side, it is written change in bold bond holdings by plus dollar one million. And on the liability side, change in money stock by dollar one million. So central bank ne jo bonds purchase kare hai. To purchase kare hai, to unke assets increase ho by dollar one million. Or because uh, in return or in exchange for bonds, central bank pays uh, the money. So the money in circulation increases by dollar one million. And it's opposite case, if the central bank sells dollar one million worth of bonds, both the amount of bonds held by the central bank and the amount of money in the economy are lower by dollar one million. And such an operation is called contractionary open market operation because the central bank decreases or contracts the supply of money. So, यहाँ पर हम इसको चेंज कर देते हैं यहाँ पर आएगा the effects of contractionary contractionary open market operation and on the asset side because the central bank sells the uh, the bonds in this case so this will be uh, the assets will decrease there will be a minus sign the assets will decrease by dollar one million right and uh, and uh, the money from the circulation will be reduced or will be decreased by dollar one million okay thank you